Hello and welcome to everyone in social study class grade 5 chapter 20 whose forest part 3 children in part 1 and 2 you have read about the forest of jharkhand in suryamani's story let's read about forest on the hills of mizoram how people live there and how farming is done. Lottery for farming in Mizoram. Children, a special meeting held in the village council panchayat. At the meeting, there would be a lottery to decide which family would get how much land for farming. The land belongs to the whole village, not to separate people. So, they took turns to do farming on different parts of the land. So, in a beautiful pot made up of bamboo, the chits were taken out. Sama's family got the first chance, but Sama sir refused to take this chance and he spoke that his sister Jerry has got married and went away. So it would be difficult to manage farming alone. So he refused to take the land. Jhum farming. Jhum farming is very interesting. After cutting one crop, the land is left as it is for some years. When the land is ready for farming, it is lightly dug up, not plugged. Seeds are dropped on it. In one farm, different types of crops like maize, vegetables, chilies, rice can be grown. Weeds and other unwanted plants are also not pulled out. They are just cut so that they get mixed with the soil. This also helps in making the soil fertile. Chero dance, the folk dance of Mizoram. In this dance, the people in pairs in front of each other, they sit in front of each other holding bamboo sticks on the ground and the drum beats. The bamboos are beaten to the ground. Dancers step in and out of the bamboo sticks and dance to beat. So it is a beautiful dance of Mizoram being practiced by the people of Mizoram in some special occasions and festivals. So now let's watch the video regarding Jhum farming. lots of forest land, but agriculture may be good for forest too. We need to learn that from the forest tribes. Jhum cultivation is done in forest. No chemical fertilizer, pesticide, etc. is used. Natural soil fertility is used to grow many crops together. And after the harvest, the land is left for some years so that it regains its fertility and new plants grow on it. After few years, People return to that land and cut all weed, bamboo, etc. and burn them. Ash makes the soil more fertile. Remnants of plants in the soil turn into humus. Then the soil is lightly dug up, not plowed and seeds are sowed. People cultivate maize, paddy, vegetables, spices, etc. together this way. Expense of Joom farming is very low. This kind of farming is done in hilly areas such as hilly area of Mizoram. People harvest the crops and carry it on their back to village and leave the land alone for plants to grow back. So children, chapter number 20, whose forest is over? So you must have understood this chapter via three parts of this chapter. So keep watching the video for the better understanding of the chapter. Thank you so much.